Two at six, our first look inside the Mobile Incident Command Center on the ground in Pike County. The sheriff's Office using the van loaned by Butler County to work on the case of eight people shot execution style in Piketon. But nearly a week into the investigation, and there are not a lot of answers, including who it was that killed eight members of one family and why. And not on your side, TJ Parker has been on the ground for us in Pike County all this week. He has the very latest tonight. TJ? Well, Craig and Carol DeWine was at those homes for several hours today. He wanted to get a first-hand account of what those crime scenes looked like to get a better understanding of what happened. Attorney General Mike DeWine speaking to the media today, saying the people of Pike County and family of those who were murdered have a right to get answers in this mysterious case. We're dealing with the cold-blooded murderers who calculated this. Thought it out, planned it, and executed it. Today, DeWine says you have to look at this differently than other mass shootings. He says this was a planned out murder of a specific family. This is an old fashioned, cold blooded, calculated massacre of eight human beings. It's absolutely shocking, some of these scenes. Pike County Sheriff Charles Reeder says his office has been working hard on the case. He says 25 sheriff departments from across the state are helping out. I have additional units from other county sheriffs from as far as away as Lake Erie to make sure that the people of this county are safe and that I have ample staffing in this county. Ultimately, what we're about today and, and for however long this takes is to find the truth. Now, Sheriff Reeder says he's assigned staff to see this case uh, through to the end. He's also speaking with family members of the Roden family in uh, talking about discussing funeral security. And uh, more on that, here is my colleague, Roseanne Aragon.